Good morning. It is May 6, 2015. The time is 05.59 a.m. Eastern Time here in upstate New York, the southern tier of New York State where I live and reside. And I want to say good morning to Barney and Ignaco Sala. Sorry if I butchered that this morning. Um, I want to say good morning and welcome. Welcome to the two viewers this morning. Now we have one viewer now. We just have Barney. Thank you for hanging, Barney. And um, I'm waking up this morning. I'm going to talk a little bit about collection of all things. Collection of all things. And I've got a little slide presentation here. And um, You know, we do things online. Party World, good morning, David. Hello, David. Yes, welcome to uh, the morning broadcast here in the southern tier of New York. David is from Ireland, Party World. And um, just sort of talking about uh, the collection of all things, David. I uh, missed the first slide. There's a slide. I don't know. You might have seen this on the Internet if you're on Google+. Plus. And i uh, got a th few things to cover over... Uh, Primarily about cur curation and of our content on this thing called the internet. And um, I was going to do this yesterday, but I got busy. Yesterday was such a nice day. I ended up doing some yard work yesterday morning after the morning walk with my son and uh, Max. And uh, what is it? Uh, had some lunch. Took a little rest. I was going to take a little rest, but then I ended up mowing the lawn, which is a good thing because it's raining a little bit this morning. It's supposed to, so that's good for the lawns. And, uh, like the solar, yes, the solar panels were out yesterday, David, too. I topped off the, uh, the deep cell by battery, so I got a very good charge yesterday. So they were out there, uh, doing the solar farming that I like to do. And I'm, I'm thinking about getting a second set. I'm, I'm, I'm really thinking about that. But the curation here, um, this is my Google Plus page, and there's something that came up on Google Plus. And primarily what it is, is something called Collections. And when you hit that, collections, you can go to my public uh, Google Plus page. Just put Rich Roberts at Google Plus or Fireman Rich or whatever on the search engines. And you'll see, uh, like the solar panels. Yes, oh, you like the solar panels. Yes, I, uh, um, I'm i a strong believer in solar power, uh, you know, as far as when you can use it. And I got a story. I'm going to have to tell the story about that uh, in one of these periscopes. Maybe I can do that later this afternoon when I get done with the day job because uh, I'm up early this morning and um, to do this uh, little presentation here. we got three viewers. Let's check the viewers. Oh, let's see. Who we got? Uh, we got uh, David and we have uh, Barney still hanging out with us. Thank you for hanging out, Barney and uh, David, a regular to the show here. And we have probably one web viewer. But curation, curations or collections... Something new on Google Plus, and when you hit that, this is, um, I made this list yesterday. It's called a, uh, uh, a list, basically, of uh, a collection of all my periscopes that I have online over on my YouTube channel. So, and the thing about creating this list, it took me very little time in creating this. It took me literally less than five minutes to make this list because from your Google Plus main page on the drop down box for each post you have put into a collections that you start and you just put a title on it and stuff so I have this and um, so this is integrated into Google Plus it just uh, it's uh, cur curating your playlist and collections of things that may be similar in this case they're all periscopes and when I'm done with this periscope it will, um, and incidentally, I do have the morning coffee this morning. So, so I have um, all of them there now. Prior to this, there's a thing called Listly, and I'm over there on Listly as well. And uh, these are some of the lists I have, and I have one for Periscope. And when we hit Periscope list lease, you can see that I have 
and you can change your different views and stuff like that as far as on this. This is I, I've used this for a couple of years now, and this is would be similar where this would go to the newest. You could switch it up to the newest, and I don't have the one. I don't think I haven't updated this yet because it doesn't have the one with the fireman uh, statue there. So, uh, but this is listly where you can create a list of curating a playlist of sorts, and uh, and you can do. You know, there's Mark Rock, and we're going to get into Mark Rock. He has something that uh, of a list that sort of give a bur uh, a sneak peek yesterday of some work concerning lists that he's working on with his team, and you get various settings. Oh, there's my ugly bug there. <laughs> But um, for the most part, it's where you can put a list of similar works uh, all together. And let's see. Oh, okay. This is a setting where you can uh, change it up. I can change it up to a, a slide presentation, minimum, minimize it as far as the list there. You can you get different uh, variations where uh, Google Plus you probably have just that particular um, setup so you can make your list like this so you can change up the format for viewing so it's it's, it's very and um, this along with collections I think are two excellent resources for anybody that's using this thing called the internet and doing any type of work there to uh, have a central location now I mentioned uh, Mark Rock I came across this on a post and ooh, there's that's a picture of Christian Payne but basically I found this over on my Google Plus timeline Mark Rock had placed a uh, a link that took you to an actual an actual audio post and this is similar I would say to Listly and the Google uh, Plus collections and you can put a picture there and I guess you go in here and you can list your works in this case these are all audios but it's a little choppy you know these are all uh, if we were to click on this you would get uh, uh, I think this is an audio an audio there that uh, Mark Rock put in the selection. They're all audios. You can put YouTube's, I guess, in there um, to like. But the collections, I think, as well as your listly lists, are far better than this that that, that Mark Rock put. He's been working on this for uh, I think it's like two years or something like that. Adio, and from what I'm seeing right now. Um, I don't know. I, I have to say it's a little bit of a disappointment in a sense that uh, um, I don't think I, I can find myself using this in uh, the sense that uh, um, compared to Listly as well as Collections. I think he, I think uh, the Adio team is a little late to the uh, party in a sense to where... Uh, uh, I would actually give this on a scale of uh, one to t uh, five stars, uh, probably a two, and I think I'm being generous with that rating. Where uh, for Listly, I would give at least a three, three and a half, and Google Google uh, Collections that I, I'm thoroughly enjoying, uh, I would probably end up giving it at least a, a, just a nudge again ahead of Listly. I find myself using this more so as a user. It's a little bit user friendly and the um, the particular uh, Adio the particular Adio uh, program you have to sign in you have to get a you have to get a uh, a login where Okay, I did that with Listly. I've got a Google Plus account. Oh, let's see. We have uh, Nikki now, and we have welcome, Nikki. Welcome to my uh, my broadcast. I'm here this morning with the morning coffee, 
and we're talking about collection of all things, some ideas to curate collection and playlists, and that would be primarily using of uh, the new Google Plus collections over if you have Google Plus, uh, Listly, list.ly, very good resource. And what's just popping up on the radar now is uh, they're still in beta testing, even though they did have a launch date, which I, I find very funny. A little comical, but I don't know. If you have a launch date, you I, I always equate a launch date with an actual product to present to the people out there. But lists for curating work is a good thing, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's a good thing. And um, that's uh, something I've been working on uh, since I started Periscope is to to archive uh, these presentations. Diff, diff helps me. What, what do you mean by diff, David? D-I-F-F. -F. Can you expand on that? Diff helps me. Is that, a, is that another application or a platform? Oh, definitely helps me. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, as far as presenting uh, for the, the store there, you, you know, just uh, you're taking pictures of partic particular products for a particular uh, season. Like uh, I think I remember you uh, saying in one of your periscopes that your 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 mom was uh, over in the UK uh, purchasing things for the store there. As far as for Halloween, you could put take pictures of all those items and you could list them on a Google. Uh, plus hang or Google plus Google plus hangouts a Google plus collection if you're on or even listly listly is very good I've been using listly for a couple of years I came across that from uh, uh, a particular person that I do follow online uh, Jane Boyd she's on Twitter at Boyd Jane uh, she's been a little bit uh, uh, silent I don't know if she's in a lurking mode she her and uh, 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 a particular uh, a close friend of hers were working on something called lurking on the internet. There's, there's some interesting stats there of uh, us people that uh, sort of wait for somebody else to put something up so they could uh, look at. But uh, morning coffee is very good this morning. It's very good, and I appreciate your views there. I don't think we have any web viewers here this morning because I don't see any coming up. We just have Nikki. And uh, Nikki, uh, I don't know if you want to chime in. It's your your prerogative as far as where you're from, but we're, we definitely want to say good morning to you. Uh, well, at least it's morning here in the southern tier. And like I said, it's raining out. We've had two beautiful days here. My last two days, uh, I've been off from the day job, so I'm going to be going into work this morning. But I wanted to present this because I, I found it very interesting. It's something I've been working on. Well... The Listly list I've been working on since I've started Periscope, which I, uh, I've been wanting to do some Periscopes, but because of time constraints and doing some uh, chores and jobs around the house here, as far as needing to get done, little nitnoy things, bits and bobs of uh, cleaning up the backyard, mowing the, the backyard, and doing some other things and stuff like that. So uh, I've been enjoying these last two days of very nice weather. Now we're into the rain as far as that goes, and I believe the uh, forecast for today, um, so right now it's about 51, 52 degrees Fahrenheit, but we have, uh, well, we got 20% chance of rain going all the way to about partly cloudy sky, it's still about 10 this morning, so we do have rain in the area. We need the rain because there's a burn ban in the state. And we're down to one now. I think it's just you and me, David. Yes, it's just you and me, David. So you get an extra thank you for hanging out, sir. I greatly appreciate. Um, and like I said, uh, the I'd like to do some more periscopes. It's just time constraints. I was trying to do one on the road. And there's my regular time. It's 5.15. I thought I shut that off. 5.15 a.m. That's the normal time I have my alarm set up. I'm usually up about a half hour to 45 minutes before that for some reason. 
again, those farmer hours that, um, yeah, wow, yeah. But I'm um, usually in bed by 7.30, 8, 8.30, 9 o'clock sometimes. And if I'm watching uh, the TV, I have to make sure I get up off the couch to go into the the kitchen to get a drink of water or just stand up because if I'm laying there on the couch, those uh, commercials, they just, they wipe me out. <laughs> I'm dead to the world there as far as sleeping and stuff. So I'm, I'm just glad I was able to do this periscope this morning concerning those uh, particular items there on the uh, uh, the collections. And like I said, the... Uh, let me get this back here so I can show you again. Patio. There is uh, Mark's Rock's uh, particular. Uh, oh, let's see what we got here. He has uh, a link there. There's a link there. And I think this is just in a test stage. So if I was to click that. Um, It'll come up with, oh, that's the one we just saw. Okay, so we don't want to see that one. There's another one. There's a really nice, neat one that, uh, just to give you a different aspect. Those were, uh, no, that, that's it again. Let me try this one more time. Let's try it over this one. Those were all audio clips. And this is something, an uh, uh, um, a particular uh, one for uh, Madonna's, uh, and it, it this is off of SoundCloud. He you can embed on these things. It's it's either a YouTube um, uh, audio clip from that program formerly known as Audio Boo, as well as uh, YouTube's. So uh, um, let me see. I go back to my Twitter line. This is my Twitter line. Did I? Uh, yes, we are live. Okay, very good. The internet and stuff. So that gives you an idea on the various... But I'm sorry to say the, the Adio, uh, this is the first time I've been able to play around with it. I sort of opted out. I didn't want to get... I could have probably got involved in the beta and stuff. Uh, from what I'm seeing right now, I'm sort of glad I didn't because it, uh, it would have been a waste of time. And I sort of had a gut feeling that it was going to be something similar to Listly. And then uh, with uh, Google Plus Collections, I think is a very, uh, is a, a pretty outstanding uh, platform. I, I'm pretty impressed as far as because it, it, uh, it's integrated, just like Periscope is, is integrated with uh, Twitter. And uh, I like that when you have... Uh, different applications that are interwoven with each other and uh, if I can find something here one last thing I think to show you if I can find it here let's see let's see I stick with listy which would be would which would you rate more uh, I think I think Listly, Listly, uh, you can put, because you can get on your account, and if I go back to this, let me show you, David. If I go back to this, and I go back to my, uh, um, can I go back? Yeah, let me show you this. Let me show you here. Okay, this is, I, I moved back, and these are all the lists that I've done, okay, and you can, this is your your main page, okay? And this is the one thing Google Plus does not have, that you can go to a, a regular page and you could have sort of an index of lists. So it's all what you want to do where um, uh, on Google Plus, uh, where is it? Right here, if you were, you just hit collections and it gives you your collections right there okay so it would take you to something similar to this so this is a little bit more eye appealing I think so I think Listly beats it out there so that's why I think Listly and Google Plus 
collections are are um, very similar, very good, I think. Uh, but I, I guess I'm just excited with uh, Google Plus uh, collections because it uh, it's new, and uh, but Listly is just as good, I would say. And so that that's my take, my opinion, as far as concerning it. Uh, uh, as far as the Adio, no, it doesn't uh, doesn't come close. It, it's just, uh, and like I said, I give it two stars primarily because um, I like my Mark Rock. You know, if it wasn't if it wasn't for Mark Rock, I I would definitely give the product uh, uh, a one star. Um, I I can't find myself u using it when I have these two other options, and I'm I'm being very honest and stuff like that. Uh, it was great when he. Uh, created and developed and got off the, the the ground there that program formerly known as audio boo but that program went in a different direction and I think so did a lot of other people because I find myself I'm doing more periscopes than I am doing audio I have to do a, 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 a particular periscope program on that one too so um, I'm getting a little long-winded here but uh, um, I'm with, still within my time constraints here because uh, um, my workflow for Periscope is to do the presentation, um, it renders, I'm able to upload it to YouTube and then it's, to, it's off on the list. So it's, I'm going to probably be, I have to look at my Listly list because I have to update that because uh, I'm, I'm thinking about just, I think it, the reason I didn't update it is let's see no poems no not today you know uh, I had fun with those two poems um, I'll ha I have to really be into one and motivated to do one where uh, captain oh uh, my captain oh captain my captain I think was a, a good one to do and trees because they sort of I think that's what poems are supposed to do it's supposed to inspire you and stuff and uh, our friend Paul Amani doing the poems. He he's doing Walt Whitman, and I catch some of those uh, when I get home because when I'm at the day job, I can't really uh, watch. Though I can sneak in a little bit to watch on the web, but um, I have other things I have to do that I can't uh, be sidetracked with that. So uh, so he he does I think a real good job with the Walt Whitman. And just being able to connect with you, David, as well as others that are here on this Periscope, and to be able to view other Periscopes, such as uh, that uh, uh, young lady over there in Paris, Claire, who is doing the uh, tours of Paris. It's giving everybody an opportunity to, to see that great city, which I probably will never visit in my lifetime, and, and so I'm pretty intrigued. Actually, I'm pretty intrigued uh, with some of the uh, the shots that Paul has done outside his little coffee shop, the filter, I think it is. I, 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 before doing this particular broadcast, I watched his. Yeah, it was very cool. And I'm all, I am I love that church that's in the, across the, uh, the river there that uh, is right there at the filter uh, cafe. I think it was, it's, uh, it's a very, very picturesque view and stuff like that and, uh, and the like, so... Um, okay, I'm going to wrap this up. Uh, Ken David, I'll give you a applause. Thank you for uh, being here, sir. Uh, I wish you well. Have a good day today. I wish all that are viewing this on the archive version over there on YouTube uh, a good day as well. Um, I don't think we have any web viewers, do we? Do we have any? No, we didn't have no web viewers this morning. So that... So... You all have a good one. You live life. Have fun. Ciao for now. And as always, peace. Thanks for sharing. Have a good day. You too, David. Appreciate it. The best to you and your family.